I and many other creators in the space agree that putting data science projects on your portfolio is a great way to improve your chances of being picked up by employers. But that does not mean that these projects are going to help you necessarily. If they are very clearly labeled as beginner projects, like MNIST handwritten digits, Titanic, and California housing to name a few, these are probably not going to help your chances at all and may even be hurting you. Now, if you are a beginner and that's really all you've got to put on your resume, of course, cross your fingers and hope that that's going to help as you apply and steadily get better and better at making awesome projects. Okay, but what actually is an awesome project? What is going to be noticed by an employer so much so that they actually reach out to you because of that project. Now, first and foremost, this cannot be overlooked. Your employer has to be able to use or at least see your application. And that means you must link on your resume and your LinkedIn and everywhere a YouTube video or the actual app itself, or at least the GitHub project showing that you did it and they can look and see what you did. Now, I think there's really two main approaches you can go with this. One is make something very easy, but then make it very pretty and more complicated or the reverse, which is make something very complicated, but it doesn't really have to look super pretty because it's already very technical. Now, an example of the simple but make it pretty category is say train a machine learning model that can recognize the MNIST handwritten digits. But instead of leaving that model and code in the notebook, you take that out and put it in a simple Android app or a simple web application, which gives a way better experience to the employer. Now, an example of the second category is maybe make a machine learning model that is very good at doing something and actually provides value to some area, but then you don't necessarily have to make a super pretty HTML app or Android application out of it. As long as it provides great value, then it's fine on its own. Now, as you may have guessed, I think the best possible thing you can do is merge both of those ideas, which is an excellent user experience and very pretty, as well as actually doing something that provides value and is not just something silly like the MNIST handwritten digits again. So if you can do both of those things, then I think you're set. But if you can focus on one of those two ideas, I think that's probably fine as well. But honestly, it's not incredibly easy to get a job as a data scientist. And so you need to work really hard to make an awesome project as well as do many other things if you can. An undergraduate and master's degree may be the right choice for you. Doing Coursera certificates may help as well, as well as so many different options to improve your portfolio. And as the cool kids say, peace out homies.